it's just a sudden shock uh, to the community and uh, his friends. Jack Taylor is the Mount Pleasant City Chaplain. He spent the day reaching out to those at the Tennessee Aluminum Processors Plant where 44-year-old Keith Frierson was killed overnight. The man in the, the department where he worked was real, you know, tore up. Taylor says Frierson is the brother of Mount Pleasant City Commissioner Chris Frierson. We're told he has family and friends throughout the area. And it sent shockwaves through the community because uh, this young man, uh, you know, he has a lot of relatives here in town. Uh, he has a lot of friends here in town, and, uh, you know, it, it, it'll hit the town pretty hard. Lieutenant Paul Westmoreland says the accident happened just after midnight Thursday. There are no signs of foul play. Police investigators and company attorney Clark Spoden say Frierson was operating a bobcat that loads aluminum pieces into a shredder. For an unknown reason, it's believed Frierson left the bobcat to check the shredder and fell in. Spoden and investigators say a company lockout tagout procedure was not followed, which could have prevented the accident. Uh, something they're supposed to do if, if something Something happens in the hopper. Uh, it's my understanding they're supposed to contact the supervisor, lock it out, uh, clear the the uh, clear the problem, whatever it is, and then turn the machine back on. According to Spoden, this is the first fatal accident in the company's 28-year history, and the Tennessee Aluminum Processors Plant, like the community, expresses its deepest sympathy to the Frierson family. We just uh, want them to know that uh, the community is behind them all the way and uh, all they have to go through, we're here, here for them. In Mount Pleasant, Erica Curry, Fox 17 News.